morning, beautiful people. Welcome back to Vlogmas Day 4 or 5. I don't know which one we're on. Um, I am on my way to my photo shoot with Agnes, as you guys know. And I'm pulled over at the side of the road because I wanted to just film a quick intro. Because I tried to put the camera on my dash while I was driving just so I could talk to you guys organically. And realized I put the wrong freaking battery in my camera. So it is dead. So the first half of this vlog will probably be filmed on my phone until I can get home and put the correct battery <laughs> back in the camera so we can film it properly. So it'll be interesting to see how I can go about filming some of the stuff for you guys. Because I really wanted to show you some of the shoot and I wanted to show you Agnes. Uh, yeah, but it's becoming one of those mornings. Like I forgot one of the coats that I needed for the shoot, which is, I'm annoyed at myself for. And then my car, I'm, I'm running behind because my car was frozen shut from the ice storm. So just, anyway, it's just becoming one of those mornings and then the camera battery on top of that. So I'm feeling a bit self agitated, I guess I could say, <laughs> but whatever, just gotta roll with it. So I'm heading to Agnes's now, I'll be there in a few minutes and I'll show you guys. What again? Okay, everyone, I'm in Agnes's beautiful home. There she is there. So she'll be taking some pictures this morning. I'm wearing the black outfit you guys saw yesterday that I was trying to put together. So she's gonna work her magic and we're gonna shoot the first outfit here and then head out on location, right? Absolutely. Yeah? <laughs> All right, and I'll, for any of you that are interested, I will leave Agnes's information linked down below as well in the description bar so you guys can check her out. come to realize that I can't see it in your eyes. No, oh, it's true. I'm so glad you feel it too. Nothing to hide for in love. This is what happens, guys, when we're trying to film for you. <laughs> Maybe because I've got it on my silly phone. Yes, we brought out our Agnes brought out a chair just for you guys. So this is where you're sitting while we do our shoot today, <laughs> or the next round of pictures anyway. Uh, and she got her lovely camera there, and then I will be in the pictures this side. <laughs> you guys are front row. Here we are. thing that we got stronger each day. We're together. Look at this winter wonderland, guys. Agnes's eye for photography. I would never have looked at this and thought, oh, here's a perfect photo shoot area, but she's found something. So we're going over to those area, or like that area with the trees there. We're gonna take some more pictures. This is my view, guys. How cute is this little corner that Agnes found? And how cute is she? <laughs> it's such a nice area though. Look how picturesque this is. And we lucked out because there's not a lot of wind or anything, so it's actually turned out to be quite a beautiful day. Standing in the snow. Okay, this is location number two, Winter Wonderland again. We've actually taken pictures here before, but I just went and changed in the bathroom in this building. And of course, got Agnes again. <laughs> That's so pretty. And then all my stuff just corralled on the ground. <laughs> but it's such a beautiful day still, guys. Hello, everybody. It is now the afternoon. It's around 1.30. I just got in from being with Agnes, as you guys saw. Uh, not sure how much footage we got, but hopefully you guys enjoyed touring around with us a little bit while we took some pictures. I'm so looking forward to seeing them. I'll get those from Agnes probably in a couple of days. And uh, of course, we'll obviously share everything with all of you guys. You'll see it on my Instagram. If you guys aren't following me there already, uh, then please do my little it's just my name, but I'm somewhere on the screen here at the bottom <laughs> uh, is my username so you guys can find me there. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing the shots. I love like winter wonderland photos. I think they're so much fun. Anyway, now that it's 1.30, I have a mess with all the stuff uh, that I brought with me. Still wearing the coat from outside. And I'm going to pack up all this stuff first just because I'm someone that if I don't like tidy something in the moment, it's just gonna get left for God knows how long. That's just how I roll. <laughs> so I'm going to tidy all the stuff up that I brought from the shoot, just make sure everything gets put away. Um, and then I have to finish up the last of my Vlogmas stuff from or like for today that's gonna get published and go live. So I need to do that. And then I have a client, um, actually a couple clients that I work with on a subscription basis. I help them out every single month by making new outfits from what they already own. And then I help source a couple of new pieces every single month for them. 
uh, and we continue on like that every single month. So uh, I have to do that. That is a virtual service that I offer. So I have those to take care of this afternoon that I'm uh, on deadline for. I need to make sure that those are done. And what else do I need to do? I know there's other stuff. Oh, I had to write out some lists for the personal style course because I think I told you guys there's things that I want to just update um, and play around with because I'm always updating my courses that I create. So there's a couple things I want to change and update. So I want to just get the outline done for that. So just some paperwork uh, and client work this afternoon. And of course the Vlogmas, but it won't matter because me talking about it, you'll have already seen the video by the time you see this one. So, <laughs> uh, anyway, I'm gonna hunker down and tidy up this room because it, it literally looks like a bomb went off, not just with the clothing that I had at the shoot, but with everything. This room is just an absolute mess right now. And I'm gonna make some coffee because if I'm honest, I'm so tired right now. I had the worst sleep last night. I don't know what it was. I just, I fell asleep okay and then was up from midnight until almost 4 a.m. yesterday, just like rolling around doing nothing. I hate nights like those. I know you guys know if you've watched Vlogmas and past, you know I'm not a very good sleeper anyway. And I actually had been doing a little bit better, but last night was brutal and the night before, just because of the snowstorm and stuff, I just an uncomfortable sleep, so. Yeah, I'm feeling a little bit tired, but I'm gonna power through. I'm gonna power through and I'll probably go to bed super early tonight. <laughs> but anyway, let's start with the cleaning and just get things a little bit more organized. Hey, the tidy is done and this is what I put on. <laughs> Why, I don't know, this is just what I felt like. So I have um, just a bandeau scarf that I put up at the top with the leopard print that I thought was kind of cute and uh, an oversized bow. And then this sweater you guys have seen, uh, if you've been watching my channel for a while, quite a few times. This was one that I picked up from ASOS a number of years ago. I just really like the flare sleeves on it. I think it's super cool. Uh, and I love this chartreuse color. I think it's really, really fun. And why not? I honestly, like I like to get dressed based on mood. So every time I'm looking for something to wear, I see what catches my eye first and makes me feel excited to wear it. And it was this color. So that's why I'm wearing so I'm wearing this sweater. Uh, I'm wearing this Tahari belt that I've always got on. Nice easy camel. And then I have these flares on with my lovely slippers. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> uh, these jeans are by Yoga Jeans. I love them, they're nice and comfortable. Uh, so yeah, that's what I'm rocking whilst working from home for the rest of the day. But I have a lot of stuff to do, so I need to hunker down. And I'm starving, I haven't eaten lunch yet, so I'm gonna eat lunch and then hunker down to my paperwork and just get, get the afternoon of work going. Okay, angels, it is uh, just past three, it's closer to 3.30 and I'm falling asleep. <laughs> I've been working on the couch uh, just for a change of scenery and I uh, just didn't feel like working in my office today upstairs so and I am I'm just getting sleepy it's just like one of those days where the lighting's low outside it's cool out and I'm like all snuggled in my sweater and stuff now uh, yeah so to wake myself up and to keep the productivity going because it's going well so far it's time for us to make a little caffeine so join me
again, angels. It's now uh, five o'clock. I'm still plugging away on the computer, um, which I know you guys don't need to film or see. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is pass you over to Sean because he's now home from work and he is going to make the broccoli and cheddar soup with you. So a little mini chef Sean. <laughs> uh, so he's going to just film the whole thing. I'm going to leave the ingredients and uh, well, unless he might walk you through the ingredients, I don't know. But at the very least, the recipe I'm going to list in the description box below. So if you guys want to replicate this recipe, you can. It is very, very good. So I'm going to pass everything off to him and then I'll let him do what he will with you in terms of uh, the ingredients. Are you gonna walk them through the ingredients? No. Why not? Just write it down. Just write it down, okay. Well, make it easier for you guys. All right, so I'll pass it over to him and enjoy the soup. So guys, we're just about to have some soup. Sean and I are being bad again. We're just having it in front of the TV. We're watching The Crown. I don't know if any of you are currently watching that movie as well, or not that movie, sorry, that show. Uh, but we are on season three, which is the newest one, but currently we're only on episode four. It's so good. If you guys are Crown lovers as well, comment down below and let me know, but I love the show. I think it's so good. So I'm just gonna hunker down, have some dinner, continue watching the show, and I'll check in with you guys later. Okay, it's that time in the night. Let's have a peek at what we've got for day five. Uh, let's have a peek over here. Okay. What have we got? Maple syrup oolong, sweet buttery pancakes. Oh, that actually sounds quite good. All right, well, let's give this a go and see how we like it.
truth. Fun fact, I actually don't like maple syrup. How un-Canadian of me. <laughs> it's okay. I don't love the tea, but I don't like maple syrup. I actually, I, yeah, I don't like maple syrup. That's very un-Canadian of me, but I just don't. I'm not even a big pancake fan if I have pancakes. This would be sad for Emerson. <laughs> but if I have pancakes, I only like a little bit of icing sugar on it and fresh fruit. I because I don't like syrup. So this is probably not the right tea for me. I will say it does smell like really lovely despite that. And the tea is okay. It's just not my personal uh, like flavor. I will drink it though. Um, but it wouldn't be something I would go and pick out in the David's Tea uh, store. But if you are a maple syrup lover, I would say that the smell is very accurate. So you would probably love it. And it's I think like a really cool like festive drink almost like a Canadian festive drink for the season <laughs> So I actually think um, yeah, it's not bad But like I said not my taste, but I'm sure there were probably a ton of you out there that would love it And it really does have that sweet note obviously like maple syrup like maple syrup does um, Anyway, I'm gonna hunker down and continue watching the crown and just disconnect for the night So I'm gonna end the vlog here uh, but tomorrow we're gonna be working together again tomorrow because uh, it's another day of the week and we all need to work. So I look forward to hanging out with all you guys tomorrow. There's lots of stuff we're gonna take care of and do together. So I'm sending you guys all the love to the moon and back and I will see you in tomorrow's vlog. Bye guys.